Okay, let's continue Tears of the Kingdom. If you're watching later on YouTube, thanks for clicking. Hope you have been enjoying. The Korok hunt continues. And let's just hopefully get through it. I don't know what number I'm at, but I'm going to assume close to 900. Your water in the grass, what, figuratively or literally? <laughs> I don't know, there are games these days that allow that sort of stuff to happen, so I can never be sure if people are talking about real life or a game. Oh, like, actually had to do it. Okay. Alright, well, it's time for Tabantha and Hebra, so... Let's see how this goes. See, I like the idea of a garden, I just don't like maintaining it. Like, you'll curse the existence of a garden when it's summer. And it's boiling hot outside. <laughs> you have to tend to your garden. Why is this... Doesn't matter. It's down now. Alright, let's take inventory. Okay, I should probably go... Should I go up there? Yeah, I should go up there. That's where the Gliok is, and I bet... I bet there's stuff there. Just water the front. The grass is... A mess at the back because of the dog. That makes sense. Oh, see, I got I got nothing here. It's just small ass apartment. That's great. Okay, I think I see one, but I'm not sure if I got it already. Yeah, low maintenance. Because I grew up with, you know, my mom, she l loves having a garden. Yeah. And I had to take care of said garden a couple of times while she was away. And I remember just the time that I, I think I, I thought I did a pretty good job, but then I accidentally uh, overwatered a cactus and it died. Yeah. So then, yeah. The joke was that I am less nurturing than a desert. <laughs> Which, that's funny. But you know, it's made me adverse to plants. Yeah, like how do you fuck up taking care of a cactus type plant, honestly? Like, no, it, that thing could have survived in the Australian desert. It spent one weekend with me and it died. There are Koroks here. Wow. Okay, I had to take care of the Gliok then. Alright, let's go.
Oh yeah, right, shit. I can't go full. Okay, now I can by doing heat resist. Where is it? Oh, I can use this to my advantage. So take this. Alright, so I'll give me hot weather attack up and then take um, this to balance it out. Yeah. So now I'm taking advantage of the fact that it's giving hot weather. Sword. Okay, I'm gonna use this time to climb up real quick. Quickly, 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 quickly. Nice. That's an efficient kill right there. They didn't get to do its airborne bullshit. Okay, now I can look for Koroks. Yeah, the game seems to put them pretty close to uh, Gleox, I've noticed. Almost sound like it was behind me. Where? Where? Oh, there. going everywhere, are we? That was, uh, yeah, an incredibly long one.
another one. I'm surprised it wasn't there. Oh shit, it's another one of these. Okay. Let's have a look around. Sometimes it's obvious. Uh, sometimes it's like a shadow thing. Let me see if I can see anything that resembles a shadow puzzle. Something that stands out. This sucks because if I don't do this now, I have to fight again when I come back. Okay, the only thing I see that could be of note is this. Something relating to the pond, maybe? Where is this Korok that I heard? Hmm. Aha! Kind of figured. Might have to come back to that. The problem is the clue may have been in another treasure and I just didn't read it. Going back up there and seeing if I can see anything. See anything. Oh. Okay, this one was simple. The other ones, like, involved a light puzzle. Something more uh, involved than that. Okay. 
Oh, see, I just did that one before. <laughs> I did that one before. I just put the sword back. So I did this in reverse order. That's kind of funny. Okay, can I... Yep, thank you. If I'm not wrong, the I don't know if there's two remaining or what. Hmm. But I gotta be close to the end of this. Next time it's nighttime, I'll I'll try and check on it. Oh, my back is gonna be long gone now, so that's great. All right, rip bike. Probably check. Uh, I guess go up that road. Well, this is where I had to help that dude. That feels like a very long time ago. It's been almost two months, hasn't it? Jeez. Guess this is what happens when you play one of these longer games. I'm gonna have to go back. Uh, I mean, this is probably fine. I'm hoping I find a lot over here. Because I didn't have the Korok mask for this section of the game at all, so... This was like the very first area I visited. There's a new harvesting game that came out, and you need to get it. You're excited. <laughs> Story of Seasons? Yeah. I haven't played one of those games in ages. I mean, Stardew Valley is probably like the last one of those games that I played. I haven't played a Harvest Moon game since the rebrand. But yeah, back in the day, the uh, the Game Boy one and which one was it? I think the DS one. Oh, I played the crap out of that. I wish I would have played the uh, the Super Nintendo one. I heard that one was always great. <laughs> oh, 
I bet scoring a copy of it, like, these days would be expensive as fuck. It's probably one of those games that's just... It's not that it didn't sell well, it's just because it's popular and old that they're just gonna... charge an arm and a leg for it. Yeah, yeah, there's enough here. There's, like, a bunch of trees. You like the ones for the Wii? I can't remember if I played one of them on the Wii. I may have. Okay, now we're... We're in... Cold territory. But I mean, yeah, Stardew has been my replacement for Harvest Moon. Especially since recently I played the, the modded version of Stardew and that was really good. Okay, there's one. That was worth going around this one for. There's so many farming sim games coming out now, though. It's like, they seem to have had a resurgence. There's just so many of them now. It's relaxing. It is. Yeah. It's definitely turn your brain off stuff. I mean, Stardew Valley, Diablo, Terraria. Those are the three games that, like, for me, I could just sink hundreds upon hundreds of hours into them and just... Time passes really quickly. There's nothing wrong with not being good at a, at a real garden. Because, <laughs> uh, I mean, that, wait, was that one? Yes, that is one, I think. That looks like one. It's like a circle formation. I usually play uh, Stardew every year, uh, just as like an end of year thing. It's been tradition over Christmas to play it. I'm definitely at 900 now. This has like this has to be at 900 at least. Gonna have to look into that one. Is it better than Harvest Moon? Uh, 
it's kind of hard to say. Like, I wouldn't say better. It's just, it's because Harvest Moon for a while kind of went in a weird direction. It was more of a spiritual successor to classic Harvest Moon, but then it had its own unique, unique twist to it. So it is very, very detailed and very, very um, long. It's really good. And uh, it's made by, it was made by one guy. It's just, you look at the attention to detail in it, it's crazy. But I mean, it has co-op multiplayer. Um, and, you know, if you're playing on PC, you can install mods, so. And the next big patch that's coming to it is just allowing developers to make mods for it a lot easier, so. It's gonna make that game even better. It is, it is definitely worth a look into, especially if you enjoy Harvest Moon. Like, I can't recommend that game enough. Uh, do I wanna... Go any further? I guess I did say I was gonna go back, uh, but there's like, there's still stuff to explore in this direction. Alright, fuck it. I mean, if you want to see what it's like, just look at uh, my playthrough on YouTube from like earlier on in the year. I mean, it is modded, but uh, it's it'll give you a good idea. Interest of sanity. It should be this. There we go, I can move better. Let me check how many hours I have on Steam for it. Hold on. Uh, just out of curiosity. <laughs> just on Steam alone, 976 hours, no big deal. And then I'm sure on the Switch that's probably like another 500 hours. No big deal. I mean, there was a period where I did not have internet, and that thing was keeping me sane. I was playing that on my Switch, like, on a daily basis for three months. And there was just nothing else I could do. I couldn't browse the internet, I couldn't do anything. It was just that bad. So that got me through that time. a lot but good definitely have more than my money's worth on that one uh oh man i don't even know where i should check 
It's these, it's the lot, like, I wish you could turn off the lions that come from a high, high ground. How do we live as kids without the internet? I mean, it's one of those things that you can't really miss something if you don't know the existence of it. I'd say just doing random shit, <laughs> pretty much. Stuff that was uh, probably very troublemaking. I mean, I know I definitely did a bunch of stuff that got me in trouble. Temporarily take this off for now. Is there anything worth along this edge? Hmm. I would say not here. Okay, so... Continue along the bridge, I guess? I don't think there is. And either way, I think it's probably better if I fly along that thing. Well, this is one of these things where this is just such a major pain in the ass. Just because if I do this without flying, I drop down and I have to climb back up. It's just, it's going to take an hour for something that probably will have nothing. Whereas in here, at least I can keep going. It's one of those things that I'll check if I have nowhere else to look. Should also be looking down to see if I can spot anything. Hmm. Get the feeling I have to drop down there. Okay, hang on. It's not that high a risk. I knew it. <laughs> this is like a Breath of the Wild thing. It was just... It's only because this connects with that big landmass and it's like the corner of it. I have been- I have played this game way too much to be knowing like that level of shit, just looking at something and going, ah, oh. ah, oh, I know what this is. Olami. Almost sounds like Gorlami. Margariti. Uh, 
I haven't seen that movie in a while. Oh shit! Game, please. It's been six months straight of Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom. Ah, uh, I hope not. Shit, people might have a point where I've just played too much Zelda. But I mean, it's... To that I always say, like... I, I want to break the weapon. Yeah. Make it run out of energy, there we go. It's like, when you're having fun, you don't notice how long someone's been pl oh, a streamer has been playing a game for, if you enjoy the game. But if you don't enjoy it, that's when you start to notice, hmm, they've been playing this quite a bit. Looks so dumb. It's a love heart stick. Well, it's okay. After this, thought I had a Korok. It's just the rattling of the weapons. I won't really have a reason to play any other Zelda games for a while. I mean, sure, there's. A couple others I could do, but I'm not gonna. It's kind of funny, like, no... People still are kind of shocked that not everyone likes Zelda. Final Fantasy next. I might do, like, something a bit more digestible before that. Before sinking into, like, something that's gonna take me another 150 hours to complete. That game's gonna take forever to complete. That thing is easily a minimum of a hundred hours, if not more. Okay, I thought I was being clever there. It looks cool, it does. I know. I'll probably enjoy it. But I think I need, like, a little bit of a breather before taking something that's, like, that long again. lines. Like I'll probably do like a couple of classic games and then do, do the Final Fantasy thing. Okay, I 
I've definitely been up here. How are there no Koroks on this hill? I find that very hard to believe. Oh, unless this is one of these situations where I have to bring, um, well, fly a Korok across. to believe this. That is so sneaky. Alright, I was right. There's a Korok on the hill. see how it goes, but like, I think the way I'm going to play it is just... If I can finish Zelda this weekend, then it'll be like a week where I'll just do some other stuff randomly in between. And then the week after, I'll probably do the Final Fantasy stuff. I'm still surprised there was only one, like you would think there'd be multiple on that big hill, but whatever. Oh, that might be why. There's a Korok camp there, which means I probably... Yeah. <laughs> probably brought it over. That's a sneaky one. How am I looking? Probably check over here, this corner.
Okay, I thought there might be a sneaky one here. Nah. Okay, I'm convinced. There we go. Uh, uh, for fuck's sake. Just thinking. Hmm. <laughs> okay, I've been up there. Alright, uh, let's just go to Rito Village. We'll go from there. Plus, I can see how many I have. It's been a while. Ah, oh, you've got to be kidding. <laughs> I don't have 900. Alright, well. Eight hundred and ninety-nine. Whatever's next is number 900. How's around Rito looking? Okay, there's like a couple of columns I haven't checked. But otherwise looking good, I just have to jump to that one. That one and that one, okay. But otherwise looking good. Rito Mafia music. immediately behind me. Okay, I just need to look like I floated over it. Wait, is that one? Alright, I got it. I just noticed the, the blocks, so I could see it. Okay, that one had one. I got the feeling it's probably not going to have any. By the way, I look back on how I got into the Rito village and I just feel dumb. Because there are so many simpler ways to get in. And I chose the complicated way. <laughs> I mean, this was very early on, so I guess I wasn't just as accustomed as I am now, but I look back on it and that was a very, very dumb way the way I entered it. I could have done multiple things. I could have used fire to create an updraft to launch over. Uh, I could have used a rocket 
and attached it onto the shield and gone up and then just glided across. I could have used the fucking tower and just, you know, glided across from the tower. There's so many ways I could have done it. And instead, I built that stupid bridge that failed multiple times. There's so many ways I could have done it in a more clever way. There's even an NPC that tells you about pine cones creating updrafts. And there just so happens to be a campfire just in front of the bridge. Alright, it would have gone off if there were one here. Thought I was diving for a sec. There's just so many different things I could have done. Yeah, but I guess that's, that's the thing. At that point, you don't really know too much about the game, so... It's like you can't be blamed. Really? Oh, on top of the house, most likely. So there's all these supplies here. Yeah, wow, that's a simple one I should have gotten. Back, go back. I also think to just how many times I forgot that I had the ability to go through a ceiling. Oh, I don't want to go look there, but I think I have to. I think I have to. Okay. Huh? Yeah, there's a lot of empty spots here. There's already one there, I can see it, on that, s that thing on its own. It's in the middle there. Is this ice cold water? No, okay, it's fine. Doubt there's anything else there. This is why I left this area till last, because it's just a mess. Yeah, there's a spot to the left.
you mean vault fin? Why vault fin? Where's chill fin? This is... <laughs> I hate getting these specialty fish. There's just so much... Okay, I chalk this up to um, not having the mask at this point. Okay, no, I'm just an idiot. I, I was here and I didn't see that. This one was like right here. Never mind, it wasn't subtle at all. It's like very obvious it was here. overlooked it shouldn't have been <laughs> I like I landed right look at this I landed right here this is the view of where I landed It's okay. No one else pointed it out as well. I'm not the only one at fault here. No one saw it. Um, okay, if I'm gonna do this, I have to eat. such a lazy thing I'm doing, but... There we go. Blend it into the landscape? What landscape? You're making it sound like the bricks were a very subtle white color. And just camouflage with the floor. They were metallic, a dark metallic gray. The Korok may as well have, like, had a bunch of landing lights just directly in front of it, and a neon sign that says, over here, Nimrod. What's... Ah, oh, wait. Snow boots, where are they? I've gone past them already, haven't I? There, jeez, I'm blind. Let's see. Here's what sucks about this area, is I can't tell what's flight and what's not. Because at a certain point, it's kind of just all blended in. Hmm, this may have been a bad idea to come up this way. Crap. Alright, now I can't even use these. Should do different colors, one for the ground and one for underneath. That would be nice. I got what they were going for, but it's just at a certain point, this becomes unreadable. Just 
a mess of visuals. Well, there's, uh... There's less than a hundred seeds to go, so... It just becomes a matter of... Uh... How well did I do? Also, there's still the Sky Island, so... I haven't really looked at any of them. I'm not quite sure how I'm going to approach that. I guess I have to just take a flying machine. Yeah, I mean, I want to finish the game this week. That's the idea. Hopefully this weekend. Like, I don't think I'm going to be done with this tomorrow, but like... I think hopefully by the end of the week I have the Koroks found. All oh, right, tomorrow's Tuesday, Wednesday. I've already forgotten what day it is. I don't know. If I feel like it, maybe. Maybe in the interest of just getting this shit done. That's all I was trying to do. Isn't that the 4th of July for you tomorrow, though, anyway? Like, you'd be getting up and preparing stuff. That works. Ah. 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 treasure. The very important. No one's coming over and the fireworks aren't till night. I don't know, like for your day. Getting up, then going to grab whatever you need to grab if you haven't grabbed it already, like setting up a barbecue. I don't know. Alcohol, sh sure. That. Oh, this is gonna take ages. Okay, maybe I should search 
the Tabantha area and then leave the high ground till very, very last. Not too many drinks you have work on Wednesday. That's fair. It's a bit of a bummer that it's on a Tuesday, huh? See, when that usually happens, I take the Monday off. Because we have a public holiday, which is basically a horse race, and it's always on the first Tuesday in November, so I always take the Monday as well. Doesn't feel like a waste. And yeah, I get, I get a day off for a horse race. on Friday taking the kids to a water park for the weekend so you had to use your extra day. Ah. Fair enough. Oh my god. <laughs> this map is just bumming me out the more I look at it. Wait a minute. There's a Korok here. I know that's because there's... Wow. I know this because there's a there's a memory there and there's no Korok that's been acquired, so I didn't acquire the Korok that's with the memory. So there's one. For some reason, I don't know why. It's behind me. Okay. That's going to disappear before I get there. I probably could have made it had I focused. Yeah. No, I mean, this is one of the first memories. I don't think it was the first one. It's definitely one of the first three. So I would have gotten the first memory, and then I got, like, the one further north first. Where is it? It's just a rock somewhere. That is, I feel like that, that feels a bit lazy. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Noted. Uh, I guess continue to banter. I wonder if there's one on the chimney of that house over there. Okay. 
Yep. Yeah. Another easy one I missed. I've never been to like a full blown water park. So we don't have any in the state that I live in. Like we have the occasional pool with like a big water slide or something like that, but nothing like a full amusement park. I mean, I think the idea of it is cool as a kid, but as an adult, I would just- I just hate anything with massive lines. And the idea of just... Especially if it's super hot and having to line up. Ugh. This was a good idea. Stressing out the messes, the line just on can't wait for long periods of time, so. I have to get the fast pass. Yeah, I mean, I don't know how those things work. Hopefully it means fast. The only time I've heard mention of fast pass is like on TV, and it's always, the joke is always like, the fast pass is never fast at all. It's just... I have no frame of reference, never been to a park that had that. shelter. Oh, yeah, I've been up here. Okay. So I'm kind of surprised there was nothing there. I need to get more arrows. Yeah. I saw there's gonna be a lot of crying and people will be staring. Uh, I mean, let them stare. Yeah. I know it can be like difficult. But honestly, sometimes it's just a case of, like, you could have the most well-behaved kid, but there are people out there that are just assholes when it comes to children. So I see it as, like, there's no point in stressing. 
At least of what other people think. Like, obviously, if you have a screaming child, that's still not the best, not the best experience. But definitely don't don't think about what others are thinking, because it's just like people are assholes. You could have the gold standard when it comes to children, but you could have someone that still just hates kids. Like, even just general chit-chat could bother them. do this. Jeez, this thing takes a hit, huh? Like, can you not hit- How come I didn't headshot that thing? So the majority of- that's, uh, ugh. I'm just noticing just- ooh, how disturbing this looks. This weapon probably isn't doing a lot. Do I have something that's more of a sneaky, stabby weapon? Not really. be a case of just the venue could be the uh the thing that carries the experience oh for fuck's sake yeah no that that's uh solid Wait, they were there the whole time and didn't help? Oh. Not one of you helped. Huh? Ah. <laughs> oh, I guess this was the last battle to do. One of them helped. They just sat and watched me from the outside.
Do these ones even break? Oh, they do. Come on, give me arrows for my effort, at least. Like, a bundle of ten. Or five. I'll take five. Bundle of five. That's a good weapon. It goes. Where is it? Ah. Yeah, ha ha. <laughs> they definitely hang out in more annoying places in this game. In Breath of the Wild, they would never be near any kind of enemy camp. Gee, I wonder if there's one right next to the ice gliok. I bet there is. Closer to that goal. Lazy car rock. <laughs> I saw I saw the little the little thing rocking back and forth. If, I'm, if I want to be that lazy. Ah, I'm just gonna carry it. Honestly, it's not that far away, and I need to head in that direction anyway. was a lot further than I thought it was going to be. And I need to walk back because, yeah. I might miss something. Okay, 
I, pro I mean, it's, it wasn't that bad, but I could have used a sled to get down here quick. There's nothing. I'm not too happy with that. Okay, I did get the Korok for that tier at least. Wait, did I? Yes. Yeah. I think so. I'm gonna have to fly over this stuff. This is just gonna take forever. Okay. I'll beat the Gliok and then I'll fly. Because I can't... Use uh, the wheels, they don't work in the snow. Did I really not get this well? Wow. Okay. Hi. Oh. Oh. I don't think I'll ever get the rest of the rewards. Oh. 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 How do you use the the overnight passes? Or is that at an inn? Lodging voucher for a reg Oh, it's a regular bird. Okay. That's oh. why. Oh. No, because I've been trying to always use the, uh, the premium bed, that's why. <laughs> that scared the crap out of me. It's alright, Creepy Zelda's not in it anymore. Alright. I gotta fight the Gliok just to get it out of the way. Oh, um. I don't like fighting this one. Okay, uh... Well, I mean, with this, I, sh I should just be able to wear... Alright, cool. I got cold resistance, so this should be enough. And I'll just take another one if it runs out. I was just moving in the snow sucks.
This is my spot. Stop. Come on. There we go. Oh shit, I didn't get it. Not enough damage. Alright, I'm gonna have to attach something onto it to get it. Noted. Do the sky thing. Oh, yeah. All right, go for the scythe. Gotten better at killing this one. Okay, now I can explore this in peace. Haven't killed any yet. They're not too bad. Once you get the hang of it. I mean, even the first time I fought this thing, it only, it only took two attempts. Alright. Let me... I'll fly around this central area. Fine. That's fine. I didn't crash. It's fine. Oh, 
is so much quicker than running. My hover bike is better than yours, in what way? Maybe I've just learnt to steer it. It is, it is annoying to steer. Just, you have to sort of do micro adjustments, otherwise you, you kind of tilt to one side and then you lose control of it. Okay, that was a fluke. It's <laughs> one right there. I just was stopping there to uh, recharge the battery. Damn it, almost landed. Yeah, you just gotta, as you go, keep adjusting it. It takes a while to get used to, but. You'll get there. Um, I can get rid of that stamp. I mean, I should probably look at the map and see if I can spot any others like that. I just don't want to bore people. <laughs> You'd be surprised how many you can just mark on the map just by looking. I'll have a quick sweep. Yeah, okay. I tried. All right, where am I headed? Uh, I should probably turn in here and just quickly check. I'll be really happy if I can get down to 50 before I get to the Sky Islands, because that, that's a good number to have. If it's any more than, say, 70, I'm going to be worried. Because what I realized earlier today is going to come into effect. Where I'm just going to have to go back to those areas where those, uh, those double Koroks were and just... I guess, repeat the area. Damn, I think I've been here before. Let me... Oh. Shit! Come back! Stop, 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 fuck, <laughs> shit. Okay, now I actually have to drop it. <sighs> okay, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Oh no, I haven't been there, okay. No, wait, yes I have. Sort of. Sort of. It's on the high ground I've been here. Which I think is enough. I mean, you gotta be careful, because if it flies away too quickly, it shatters and then you lose it. <laughs> it 
Yesterday I had one. When I was trying to save it. It uh, was going so fast that it killed an animal and then it hit me on the way down as well. And hurt me. And sent me rolling down the hill. It's pretty funny. Yeah, no, talk to the sages. Don't get on the bike. There we go. Oh my god. Steering. Steering. <laughs> I have to let it go again. Speaking of, where am I right now? So I'm like halfway up, up the mountain. I was trying to turn it so I could go up, but it was like on this awkward angle. Okay, there we go. That's better. I just want to check the top of this right away. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, up we go. There should be one up here. Hey, 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 hey. 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 <laughs> Shit. Oh no. Oh no, it's gone. It's gone. It's fucking gone. Yep, it's gone. Okay, well. I know, yeah, I'm, t I'm totally so much better at controlling that thing. I love the part where I didn't lose control of the, the flying bike and it totally didn't go down the mo mountain and shatter into a million pieces. Oh my god. <laughs> there isn't even a Korok up here. What? Why? Why is there no Korok up here? There's always one at the mountain peaks. Really? Nothing? I don't believe that. Or is this because this is where the quest for... for it starts, for this area? That might be why, but... I find that so hard to believe. Ah, oh, god damn it. <laughs> That's why. I need to reach my friend. Is your friend at the top of the mountain where I just was? Okay, that's not too bad. He, he's not. I thought it was going to make me climb the mountain. Okay, well... This is like P 
peak laziness. Okay, I need to be very delicate with this. As if I overshoot it, he's uh, gonna go somewhere I don't want him to. In fact, I think I should go off the ground. It makes more sense. Oh! No! You dick! I thought I got it perfect. No, you know what? It's fine. It's fine. It'll still work. It'll still work. It'll still work. Let them die! Okay, well, I feel like I've gone too far into the mountains now. I wanted to check over here. So I'm going back down that way. That worked. This is 100% the new snowboarding track. It's just it's way too uh, convenient. There's nothing here. I definitely haven't looked at everything here. Hmm. I mean, there is a double Korok there. Okay. I should probably check how many, um, bubble frogs are left. I can come back to the tower, anyway. I want to see what happens when you collect all of them. If the dude actually becomes um, the majestic creature. There we go. Okay. BRB, gonna check in on it. Plus, we can see how many Koroks I'm at now. It's been a while. 917. All right. All right, all right, all right. 83 to go. Well, there's still the Sky Island, so if I can get it down to the final 50 and it's Sky Island, I'll be happy. I may have arrived here too late. 
I'm gonna make it night time again. Also tell me where the caves are, so I thought he was supposed to reveal it. Alright, well. Didn't. Well, a hundred remaining to eat. It's not that there's a hundred in total. He would have eaten a certain amount already. But I guess there's no way for me to know, really. Uh, I think this is probably easier if I shoot myself into the air. Because there's, I think there's caves in the sky as well, that's a thing. It's, you know what? It's possible that on the starting island I missed, I missed some caves. I bet that's what they are. If they're not, if I can't find them, they'll be there. Because I didn't exactly explore that island completely at the start. I just kind of got through it. I, I missed a bunch of stuff. Where have I? Are there bloopies in the Sky Islands? I, you know, I don't remember. I don't think I've ever seen one, but maybe on the starting island. I wouldn't be surprised. Alright, I'm just gonna drop down anyway. I was just using as this as a shortcut, I guess, to get down over here. Alright, that looks about right. I mean, let's look at it. Yeah, look. There are caves. So I would bet that the... I can, I would bet that there are caves up here that I haven't gotten. In fact... <laughs> I would imagine there's like a handful of Koroks I haven't gotten up there as well. It's 
probably going to be my, the first place I look when I get up to the, the Sky Island search. It's not marked with a cave with the icon. Yeah, it is. Look. See? Tick. Tick. It's marked with a cave. Yeah, I can't tell what I've done with that. That's like a mess and a half. Feels tiny. Yeah, fair enough. I only brought it up for like a split second anyway. Love that that's that's the whole thing. Man, I thought it was way later, but it's only eleven. Already see another one. I guess because I, I at this time I've swapped games, but I'm like I'm I'm doubling down the effort on finding these. I need to pay my my secret spot a visit. I can hear a wolf uh, trying to attack me. Ugh, there's so much there. I might use that cave to go high ground and then drop down. Tiles to beat here. Yeah. Not sure if I beat in it already. <laughs> wakey, wakey. Yeah, I've been in there. I was only gonna fight it if I hadn't. Fuck. Okay, it's being weird. See how high up this takes me. Wait, the mask's going off already. Oh, okay. Ha <laughs> ha 
Where am I going wrong? Oh, it's here. I wanted to climb a little higher, but it didn't go up that high. Is this a lot? I needed to go further in the cave, but just uh, the parade was uh, was there. Uh, fuck it. <laughs> I guess now that that's there. I'm always going to go to high ground anyway, it's just I figured... It would help a bit if I did it. Lazy Korok! Which means I have to make a flying machine. Well, that's good. If I get another five, four Koroks, that's ten seeds, so I can't complain. It's all the way over there. That's a, that's an eternity away. I need to go get more fan. It's not that bad. It's quite the distance. I think it's... And it's in snow as well. It's like just going to take longer to walk it. If it was on normal ground, I think it'd be fine. Yeah. Right, let's Plus, it'll let me explore this a bit better, so. Oh no, this would have taken ages. No way. This is, this is ages away. This, this would have taken ages. It was like a solid 15 seconds of flying. But for a second there was another one. All right, onwards. I don't think I've been in the Synox. I went for like a, a massive hit. Beat it already, oh well. Oh shit. Oh no. Someone got the hit in. Good. I mean, it's worth it for the bow alone. I think the bow definitely made it worth it. So here's the thing, in Breath of the Wild, there's one here, but I can't remember if I got it in this game. I did not. <laughs> this is where the memories are like starting to mix in, because this was like one of the last areas I looked in, in Breath of the Wild. It was a different Korok type, but yeah.
Memories blended in. Is that a Korok? Oh, yeah, it is too. Now this is the end of the line. I just go up and turn around. Okay, we're going up here. All the work for possible poop. Yeah, I mean, it's most likely the same reward as last time. I'm not kidding myself. I'm, I'm not imagining it's going to be any different. Uh, I'm just debating what I should do here. I kind of gone. All, I've already gone along the peak here, but granted, it's like without the Korok mask, I've gone along the peak. <sighs> I guess that's the thing I gotta remember is like, this area was without the mask, so I could have missed stuff still. I guess it doesn't hurt to just fly around it again. here actually get some battery back Okay, I can see the Korok on top of that mountain, so it's unnecessary. Hmm, that would have gone off by now. Alright, I'm landing it here. so far. Okay, I just wanted to convince myself that those two are nothing. Ugh. Go down one more level. Oh shit, no, no, no. Careful, 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 careful. Jeez. Need to land over here. I 
This will just take forever. You made a killing machine yesterday and it worked for a little while, then it broke. At least yours worked. Mine just have a habit of exploding. I gave up. It's... I'm no good at that. Losing control of it. What? I'm more. Yeah, I'm more in the moss. What the hell? Why is this so? Oh, shit. Okay, I should check this cave. This is, this is like a special circumstance, this cave. I just realized why it might be empty out there. Yep. Ah uh, ha ha ha, that makes sense. Because this is a special cave. It's not... Normally caves don't have... Um... Koroks, but this is a different cave. The Leviathans do. Alright, where is it? Wait, there's a second one? Unless it's like one per eye. We did a Roomba thing with a Zonite head on top, and then a Hydrant, and then a Shock on the side, and a Stabilizer. So what, you would... <laughs> Prime them with water and then they'd get shocked. Don't tell me my bike just disappeared. Really? I didn't even go that far away from it. Whatever works. As long as it it hurts something. I mean it did its job unlike my stuff. Did not do a damn thing. I hate how it just gets rid of your stuff. If you walk too far away from it. That was that wasn't even that far away. Alright, well. Guess I'm walking now. Now that I think about it.
Yeah, by the I did get struck by lightning earlier, and I had almost had one of those fall on me. Right on top of me. This is largely disappointing. <laughs> I was expecting something here. I don't think I'm gonna narrow it down. Okay. That's one. There's like that lower shelf underneath as well. I'm going down that. And then I'll teleport back up instead of climbing. Kind of slowed down a bit in terms of number of Koroks. But that's to be expected. This is bad. I should be walking to the end. <laughs> Nothing! <laughs> okay. I'm teleporting up here now. Anytime I hear the final countdown, I just think of Arrested Development. Anything on top of Selmy's house? No, it would have gone off already. Tell me it's like ah, uh, that's why. I'm like that's weird. I'm surprised I didn't see this one. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, 
Yeah, a lot of the ones that I've missed in this area have been that. It's just because I wasn't aware that uh, they existed, pretty much. Okay, so there's two trails I need to take. So we're going... Which one? One's like immediately this way... Mm, can't tell. <laughs> Is it that way? I'm trying to go this way. Fuck it. I think this is correct. Oh wow, they're like, uh, ready to get me. vertical one. I'm kind of surprised. I was expecting at least one. Oh. Well, there's no point in going further down. I'm going back up. Alright. Back up. That was, uh, that was very disappointing. There was nothing. I was expecting at least one near those trees. such a hassle. And I need to, yeah, check out this high ground here. Oh, Bloopy. A cave I haven't gotten. To remain. Oh, I've got in the cave. <laughs> False alarm. Three remain. It's just a cave that passes through. Fuck, I did this. <laughs> this is the smarter thing to do. Just go back to the top. This is just mentality from Breath of the Wild where I didn't use fast travel. What the fuck am I doing walking up a hill? I have no business doing that. This time it's allowed. It's gonna be a lot of fast traveling back to the spot. What is it with the flags in this area and just being laggy? Okay, uh, 
Uh, I need to go. Turn this way. I need to match it correctly. That way. Okay, straight ahead. I haven't beaten that Gliok. I'll keep following this down. Probably just gonna teleport back to the top. <laughs> Did I just get hit? <laughs> Did I just get hit by a rock. I kind of figured this peak would have one. Oh, that's just... Does the scythe... That's just annoying. Ow, I'm gonna go with Ow. Let's see what else is here. I mean, I should check that shelf, but I'll probably go up and go back down again. Because I think I've reached the bottom now. Oh no, there is definitely a Korok at that thing. Hang on. At the flight pad? No, there's definitely a Korok there. Oh, you know what? I can use the tower to shoot myself back up. I'm right here. Okay, I mean, the tower's kind of... Can I even get there? I think I can. The flight range without question has one. I refuse to believe it doesn't. I think I just went past it because... 
Chulin or the mini Yeah. <laughs> it's just on the roof. This is just Breath of the Wild knowledge again. forgot about that like <laughs> oh, I mean do I believe that there might be more than these one oh. this dock is probably gonna have one and one of like these will as well yeah I have to check that like there's too much there there's too many islands I can't be lazy about it Fine. Alright. I should be able to see it from above. Okay, so let's start here and I'll go to the left. Hang on. Okay, nothing here. Uh, I think this is just to make a gust of wind. Yeah, okay, that's fine. I already got that one. Is this ice cold water? No. But it's still probably easier just to teleport to the tower, get shot out. No. Come from this side. I think it's safe. 9.30. Five and a half hours left. Ah, yeah, well. You'll survive. Whoops. I think that's what's making it worse, is the fact that you know you have tomorrow off. That's a Korok there, that's a bus shelter. Two Koroks! This is a lazy Korok and a bus shelter.
<laughs> Did I just get shot? Someone clearly did not like me doing that. Oh no. Where? What's worse is your husband is off the hallway. Well, that's just rude, isn't it? I haven't made one of these in a while, but I don't see any... I feel like a flying machine is a bad idea in this regard. I don't think this will ever be perfect center. So, I guess bait make a face this way. Okay, and then... I will have to use a fan. Just gonna <laughs> keep giving him an ice bath. Hold on, little friend. I think this is my bad. I should have done it this way. There we go. Is that better? I'm not sure that's better. Alright. It's just a, a little cruise along the river. I'm not wasting another fan on this. This is fine. It'll get there eventually. Yeah, it's moving. There were no other fans there, so it's all right. It's going to uh, give me a sec to think. Like, where else could I possibly go? I think I need to go back to the tower. Pressing down on the analog stick does not help it in the slightest. And what I'm gonna do is, the moment I reach the shore, I'm gonna convert this to a flying machine. That's my plan. Don't waste the parts. I should have just pulled out two fans. This is probably the safest 
I've had, uh... I've had this Korok, yeah. Like a very leisurely cruise down the river. Oh, I have, I have to take him to shore as well. There you go. Two hours later. I'm good for this. The other one I saw was just another uh, uh, air pocket thing. Okay. Ugh, man. Alright, we're heading... Hold on. This way. If I can steer it in that direction. Is here. Okay. I see where I am. Just taking flight along the paths where. Wait, r really? I guess I never came up here. Is this a new cave or is this just linking to another one? No, it's a whole new cave. Wait, yes, it's a whole new cave. Alright, so now two bubble frogs remain. I'm probably going to lose my bike. It's so strict on how far away you can be from your vehicle before it just disappears. Yeah, oh, bullshit, it's gone. <laughs> ah. Oh, that's it. That was just a quest. The block cave. Yeah, I really should have done that early on. <laughs> No, it's like there still might even be a cave. Um. Uh, all right, I'm gonna be lazy. I want to check that mountain.
I mean, I might, I might be able to do this. Like if, if I find a couple of lazy Koroks here and there, it'll get to 940 and that's still, that's still pretty decent. It's not horrible. I'd say that's pretty respectable. I swear, the amount of times I, I go to one peak and then it's like, haha, there's nothing here. Only to go to the one immediately across it and then it makes me run back. Yeah. Wait, circle of rocks. Is that new? It's new. I saw it in the background of the Korok that I just did. Ah, it just moved. Nice, nice. This is the path that I didn't take because of the cave system. I thought that was a Korok down there for a sec. It's not, it's just hot air balloon parts. Yeah, I've been down there anyway. <laughs> it's hot air balloon parts to get up here. I almost jumped down. sages that are following me you, do, do you wanna maybe I don't know attack five one of the many five sages Yeah. 
Ha ha. Under as well, just for good measure. Okay, I mean, in Breath of the Wild, there was an ice talus here, and also a couple of Koroks, so. Mark that over there. Oh, you know what? There was a cave over here that I never found. But maybe I did find it. I was never sure. Like, I was convinced there was another cave over here. I think there is. Alright, anyway. I'm gonna fly over there. It was kind of hard to tell because there was a blizzard. <laughs> Alright, well, here we go. Uh, what do I have to stop by? I'm going to put some markers along the way. Uh, what am I even looking for? Okay, the Byron Snow Shelf. That's going to be paid a visit. That is completely empty. There's nothing here that I've gone. Same with here. In fact, just, just this whole general area. Uh, it's just rough. Alright, that should do. Alright, which one's first? I <laughs> probably should have looked at which one's first. Uh, gold? Gold. Okay. Shit! Oh, that was bad. Try again. Ah, damn it. I mean, yeah, I'm gonna lose my bike if I get that horn. I'm leaving it. Okay. This way. It's not a car, right? No, it's just a campfire. Rock. Yeah. Ha ha. I think I got close enough to that. Yeah. 
Lazy Korok. And I gotta come back to the spot when I go deliver the Korok. Because this one has stuff in the middle, and it could very well be like I miss out on one as a result of delivering this one. Ooh, that might not work. Let's see. It's a little bit off center. Okay, there's one there. I can see it already. But see, if I didn't see it, and just assumed everything was a- You know what? I'm getting it now. What am I waiting for? <laughs> I'm still gonna backtrack, because uh, there's probably like another. But see, that's- see, this is the exact problem that I'm talking about, is like, I- there's probably... There's probably a bunch of circumstances where I've just delivered a Korok and missed one or two as a result. <sighs> I would not be surprised. There's another one on that hill. That's how evil those Koroks are. Because they are really to serve as a distraction. Okay, I'm gonna humor me. And yet, <laughs> there's another one here. That's not the one I was going for. I thought that maybe that one would be from underneath, but... Alright, that works too. Hopefully my bike doesn't disappear. It's really not valid. Oh, it has to cover all of them. That's not enough. Okay, I'm gonna come back for this one, because otherwise my bike's gonna disappear. But I know it's here. Unless it's already vanished. Where'd I put it? Or did I walk past them? I would have been up here. Let me see. My bike really already disappear. I, I really don't like this. I didn't even go that far from it. Well, I'm out of fans, so I need to go get more. Alright, well. I need to go back where I came from as well, still. 
Guess we're doing this. Great shelter. But I should have just gone back up the hill. Alright, I'll walk it up. Yeah, so in the line of that Korok, well, in the general area of that Korok, that one Korok that I had to deliver, there have been three. That makes me worry. Roughly around here, so let me see. Yeah, it was like there. You can see it. All right. Yes, I got a tail. Finally. Well then. Where? So, what, that makes four? I mean, I guess there's no way the mask would have detected it from low ground, but... Wait, where is this thing? I thought it would have been here. Stops there, so <laughs> what? Oh, it's a flower. I see it. It's on the base. Gonna end on that arc. Yeah. Go back and check all the two X's. I think I will. Just once the Sky Islands are done. Oh, that's gonna suck! <laughs> but if this one serves as any example, look at this shit. It made me it made me pick it up here. One, two, 
three, and then four. Oh, that's... Oh, that's... That's not good. Fuck, I wish... I wish I came to that realization sooner. Oh, I'm so worried about this. this um. Alright, anyway, go to the snow shelf. That's what I was trying to work out. Like, what was I doing? Because either something to fight here or Korox. <laughs> One or the other. Wait, oh. No, wait, this is where we fight the Gleer. Oh, yeah, no, I have to fight this Gleer. We're fighting this Gleer. What can I get away with here? Okay, this is what I can get away with. Okay, clip the good boat. Did it really just go away from me? <laughs> Love that the whistling works. Hey, dickhead. Alright, let it let it be, let it be. It'll, it'll drop down in a minute. There we go. It's on an awkward angle. I can't stand on it without slipping. There we go. Got it. Okay, that'll do for that one. To do it. I was about to do it. Oh yeah, no, shoot wind through through the solid block. That makes sense.
Yeah, bitch, you're not going anywhere. Oh shit, it broke before I could get the last one. Nah, damn it, I couldn't get the last one. Okay, we're using heavy artillery. Just kill it though. That's so annoying that the heads are gonna recover. This is just RNG at the end of the day. It's just, don't get hit, don't get hit. What the fuck was that? Alright, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. No hit, no hit, no hit, no hit, no hit, no hit, no hit. There it is. I need more arrows. <laughs> I'm almost out. Okay, back to this clothing. Alright, so I mean, there's not going to be any Koroks here. Um, maybe... Oh, you know what? I bet there's a sneaky Korok. There's a sneaky car up. Why is it that they're always... There's always one that seems to be immediately next to the Gliok. No, anyway, this is a bus shelter one. Which you can't do unless you drop from above, so. Okay, that should cover it. Yeah, ha ha! I'm getting rid of the star, that's, that's nothing. I don't think I need to check out the rest of the snow shelf since there was a Gliok up there. I did just get one. Didn't know that was a Korok thing. Oh, yeah, no, that one took me a while to realize it was. It clicked when I saw one that had a missing piece. It had, like, a hole in the middle. And then I went, oh, that's probably a Korok. And then I thought, oh, I've seen so many of those and didn't do anything. <laughs> So, yeah, unfortunately. <laughs> Heading to red. They're kind of everywhere. Okay. I mean, after this one, I'm gonna go get myself some fans. Yeah, they're just, they're just everywhere. I mean, how... Ah, oh, see, there's another level up still. Nah, fuck it, I'm getting fans. It's it's honestly easier to just... Um, I forget which one's... Aside from this one... 
But I know there was a better one somewhere in the sky. Hang on. There was one of them where the odds of getting fans are really good. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This one gives good. That one's nothing but flying machines. Nine forty-four. Ho 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 ho. I might get to nine fifty. Look at all the stuff. There we go. <laughs> That's it. All right. Uh, now. Down. Where do I even go from? Hey, let's, let's just go from... From Selmy's again. It's a good base of operations. I can't believe I've just, like, jumped... 200 and something Koroks in a couple days. So I need to go to this this thing here. in the car at the top of the hill, right? Yes. Alright, so it's just a... Shit. Oh my god. It just... It just shattered. It's alright. The parts didn't completely disappear. I accidentally pressed B. Look at how much damage it did to the book up once. And now they blow the alarm. Too late. Peace. Ooh, ice. 
Mm, nothing. been here before if the president's done the ah oh, shit gotta let it go going up I guess this is all good then. Alright, so if I go directly across this, that's gonna be. It's gonna take me across to the snow shelf. Okay. Just head for that blue marker. Also take a quick look around here. this little yeah here okay there's nothing Okay, <laughs> I guess I'll just smack bang put it on the car off. That's cool. Wait, what am I making here? Ah. Where was I going? There was a spot. Oh, man, I don't even remember. Oh, here. And then I guess it's like up here. For now. Shit. Dickhead! Oh. I just caught that. Okay. Very good. This, this is what I want. <laughs> Hopefully, didn't go down the hill. <laughs> the 
go down the hill. Oh no. Where's my bike? Did I lose my bike? I think I did. I'll have to make another one. I thought I landed it fine, but no. Alright, I was going to purple next. Oh, this is awkward. Nah, fuck. This can't seem to steer it sometimes. And then other times I'm doing these crazy turns. I'll knock it off. You're not that unstable. Okay, there we go, there we go, there we go. Okay, nothing here. Okay, that's the bus shelter I did earlier. Up we go. Ah, oh, there were more planks of wood above. That is sneaky. I'm gonna land it here and turn around. Sages! I think we can delete these pins. Yeah, okay. Um, now it's just this area here and here and back here. Alright, so just loosely. I should do, right? gonna fail immediately. Where are we going? We're going... green? What's with purple? Oh, purple's a leftover. Um... No, it's not. Talus there. I'm not sure I've fought it. Alright, let's fight it. Assuming I haven't beat it already. Okay. 
Did I beat it? Yeah. I have not. Alright. And annoyingly, it's one of these ones where it has it on its back. Oh, no, it's not. I am wrong. hasn't gone back for more frost. Okay, ow. There we go. Get coded again. It's fine. Fly now. Well then. Isn't it? Is it this it? Or is this like... Hang on. No, it can't be it. It's gonna be something like this. like a 3D hashtag. Korok there on the right. <laughs> it's amazing how many arrows I had and how many I'm down to. spot and get more. It's, just, it's on the other side of the map. <laughs> I 
Ah, it's just a Lionel, who cares? Ooh, the Lionel's going to attack me! Oh no! I think it tried to shoot an arrow at me. I don't go down to that level yet. Oh, this is kind of awkward to land. There is a Korok here. Oh, yeah. No way I was going to land that. It's gone. That was wishful thinking. Gotten better at fighting at though. Yeah, just practice, and then you see that they're not too bad. Aha! Uh -huh. Alright, well, I'm just gonna continue along here. It's gonna fly, but I lost my flying machine, so. Was that a sign? What was that? Something flashed and then it disappeared. Is that just an enemy camp? What did I say? Okay, well this is just worth doing. Just to get the extra height. I think I'm done. Yeah, I already got the car on that hill. Okay, well now I gotta turn around and go to that left lowland over here. And then that's Hebron more or less done. I mean, uh, there's still... There's still patches everywhere. Because there's something that I'm not very happy with. Hmm. Uh... Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Thinking. Is that what? Well, I mean, I can. It's the the spot here specifically. Hmm. I guess if it, if it's really that bad, I can go back to it. But I mean, otherwise, I think I'm done. Okay. Like, this part's pretty well filled in. I just, I hate exploring the mountains, I really do. What about here? Ah, uh, fuck. No. Yeah, no, there. That, I flew over that, you can see it. Okay, but that one's easy to do, that's just like... Wait, I gotta finish here first. That one's easy to do. Because at least there's a shrine next to it. The worst part about this is like, Whenever I see a 2x, I just think, shit, 
I need to go back there. This last 50 is going to suck. <laughs> down there, right? Yeah, down there. Is that another talus? I think I may have beaten this one already. Let's see. Oh, okay. Yes, yeah, defeated. It's fine. Damn it! I didn't want to fight you. Oh my god! Fuck off. Just because of that boss there, I think it's kind of safe to say there's nothing there. Give up. Holy shit. I could reach that far. Stay down, dickhead. I can't believe how far I can throw that. Alright, well, I'm back here. This is where the lazy Korok was. Okay, that's, that's it. That's a full Tabantha lap. Alright, maybe we should climb up there. That's a full, full lap of Hebra and Tabantha. this game. Unbearably cold, you say, but it was raining. What? <laughs> Ugh, whatever. It ra it rained for for five seconds just to fuck me up so I couldn't climb up. And we're forced to change clothing. Look, there's no rain here. I think I beat this one already. Pretty certain. Yep, defeated. Alright. I think we're good. Uh, where was that spot that I identified that I want to go back to? What was it? Here. Right? Yeah, it was here.
It'll bother me otherwise. <sighs> Nine forty nine. Why am I always one short of my goal? Oh, yeah, right. Swap back to. I was like, get the 950. direction was it was that direction yeah so this is the part that i just floated over <laughs> those stupid lines i just can't tell where i've been anyway okay and there's nothing here great use of time All right, I'm wrong. Now we're at 9.50. So when I got to 9.79, that's... 979, a uh, 579 on the indicator, that's where we're done. I mean, it'd be great if I could get a second one. I'm not even sure what I'm gonna do. Well, I guess. Sky Islands first, then all matters desperation afterwards. It's just, I could spend here all day. I just, I keep looking at this map more and more and it's still like, dude, there's, there's stuff you haven't done. Clearly. Like. I suppose it's not too bad. I gotta remember that the mountains I don't need to be super pedantic with. Um. They're just honestly not that picky. Wait, what about here? Did I, did I do well here? Let's see. Mm -hmm, I guess. It seems fine. Where I just gotta look. Where are the black spots? Like. Look at all that green, where? I mean, some of the stuff, for example, doesn't count. Like, that's a massive field. There's nothing there. Some of them, I just left them because it's like... Like in Breath of the Wild, there's nothing there. Like here. Oh, when I zoom out. Okay. Yeah, I mean... I think the Breath of the Wild map was way more chaotic than this. Oh! Wait, 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 wait. Did I go to the labyrinths? All four... Yeah, hang on. I don't think I went to all the labyrinths, so hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. There should be a Korok at every labyrinth, so, yes. Did I go to this one? Ah. Well, it depends if the- oh, but that's in the ocean, it might not- No, I'm going to this one. I'm gonna follow the rule.
Okay. I didn't go to this one because it was offshore. It wasn't part of the mainland. Is this thing? Was this here in Breath of the Wild? Looks like another, uh, hang on. Another Leviathan. I think that's off the map. I don't think you can actually get there. Can't see it, there's like a horn there. I'm not sure you can actually get to it. Where am I? I'll run around the whole thing. Doesn't look like there's one on this one. They might just be mountains, I might just be using my imagination a little too much. I mean, they don't look like mountains, it looks really weird. Aha! Okay. Shit. <laughs> I need more arrows. Okay. That's all the labyrinth white, because I, I, I know I got this one. Yeah, so I got that one. And what about in the sky? Do I... I'm pretty sure the sky one I was on top of. Yep. So hang on. Uh, where's the other labyrinth? Yep. Just making sure. Ah, so the Korok in the sky matches the location of the Korok in, on the ground. Okay, cool. Glad I caught on that one. That's- that one being isolated on its own has the potential to, uh... Yeah, be annoying. Okay, I'm getting some arrows. Alright, 49 to go. I'll be curious to see how many are on the starting island. Let alone caves and all that shit.
Ah, oh, dickhead. I wanted to stop that from happening. Stop it! This one in particular. There we go. Get out of here. That's it, right? Cool. Let's come back to the ship because it's just the best for arrows. Let's say there's only 10 on the sky, the starting sky island, that's still quite a bit. <laughs> no idea what region the final cave is going to be in. That's anyone's guess. Wait, is it? No, there's two. There's two caves left. Alright, still. How many arrows do I have? Look at how many- look at how many arrows this gave me. It gave me like 50 arrows. This place is awesome. <laughs> Fuck spending money on arrows. Yeah, this is the best spot to get arrows, I'm telling you. Unbelievably good. I don't know if there's any other crates around. No. Okay, but yeah. It's like 50 arrows from one trip. Alright, for curiosity's sake, I just want to see this map. What is the likelihood? Like, what's some low-hanging fruit? Okay, the roof of the Temple of Time. That's one. Hmm... I doubt it'd be so, like, annoying to put it on the perimeter, though. Uh, this is a little scary. I don't really... St but then again, yeah, the problem here is, like, I may have gone there, but it doesn't necessarily mean there isn't anything there, because this was, like, the very start of the game. So it's possible there were... Clorox there, I just didn't find them. Yeah. 
Yeah, I don't know, man. This... If I was to assume I spotted everything correctly, this looks fine. Yeah. <laughs> I'm worried now. Alright, I'm gonna... I didn't have the mask, so I guess let's just hope. Oh, this is gonna suck, isn't it? It's just gonna be like flying around to every single island. Okay, I'll try the roof of the Temple of Time at the very least. It's going to be the 2x thing, like... This is this is it. Like I have to go back through the the areas that had two times Koroks. That's what it's gonna come down to. I've kind of accepted my fate. That's what it's gonna be. Okay, I'm wrong. It's under the Temple of Time. This one, I guess, the, the, yeah. I bet there's one on the roof as well. Oh, wait, but didn't I go to the roof? Hang on. I went to the roof once. Let me go again. I may have gone to the roof already. Because there was that, um... That side quest. I mean, I think the best move here is to go by bike, but for now... Now, let me walk around the roof. Check up here, so. <laughs> Nothing <laughs> about down here. Nothing. I guess because this is technically a bridge, that's why. I 
Alright, I'm not gonna go down this rabbit hole tonight. I just noticed the time. So, tomorrow I'm gonna pick it up from here. Not tomorrow. Well, I don't know, maybe tomorrow. We'll see. Depends how I feel after work. But it's time to leave it here. Uh, I got I got the feeling just after the realization today of the, the 2x Koroks. I'm gonna... Fuck, I'm gonna have to go back. I'm gonna have to look on the map and point them out. I might do that off stream. And just put like a little marker next to every 2x Karaka I can find, and then it's just like, those will be the likely su suspects on the ground. That's what I'm gonna have to do, so. Yeah, fucking sucks, right? But like, it dawned on me today when I saw that happen, and it happened again in Hebra, so it's definitely a thing. Yeah, fuck me, right? <laughs> anyway, thank you for watching, everyone. Uh... Especially if you're watching later on YouTube. Hope you enjoyed the Korok hunt. We'll hopefully put this to a close in the next few days. And, uh, yeah. Look at finishing the game. Uh, if you wanna support content, clicking something, algorithm buttons, whatever I usually say. <laughs> I'm tired. But, uh, yeah. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thanks for doing stuff if you do click buttons for algorithm purposes. It does help the channel a lot, so appreciate you. Uh, I'm going to bed. Clearly, I, I can't talk anymore, so I'm just going to go crash, and I'm going to go think about my current situation with this. <laughs>